So I found out what happens when you close the refrigerator. Oh, no. oh gosh! Dang it, James Charles, what the heck, man? That was scary, jeez, out of nowhere. <laughs> Oh my gosh. James Charles, what are you doing in my refrigerator? Come on now. I understand if you want a midnight snack, but geez, all you have to do is ask. Just out of nowhere. Hi, sisters. Come on now, we need to get that out of here. That was scary. I'm like on edge right now. Like, I feel like James Charles is just gonna pop out of nowhere and be like, Hi, sisters. <laughs> But today we're reacting to TikToks that are actually funny. I know some of you might be on the fence about TikTok. You're like, oh, it's lame, uh, it's not that good. But there are some out there that are actually funny, so we're gonna check them out. Hopefully you guys laugh at them. If you don't, then I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Go ahead, please give this video a like. It really helps out the channel, helps the videos do better, and subscribe to the channel. And we got new Get That Out of Here merch, so click that link in the description below. Get there and get some. Crowdmade.com slash Smith. get there yet. And yeah, comment down below your at. It could be for your TikTok or your Instagram, let me know. Mine's at Dang Matt Smith, if you didn't know. But yeah, let's go ahead and move on to another, another one. Talented, brilliant, what incredible, the? <laughs> amazing, show-stopping, spectacular, this never This cat looks same, like it's in the totally army. Totally unique, completely not ever been done before. Oh my gosh. Look at that face, I mean, dang. This poor cat is just like, get this thing off me, right meow. I don't know what's worse, the fact that this girl done put a croc on her cat's head or the fact that she owns crocs. You guys better not be owning any crocs, all right? I feel bad. Poor Garfield. I mean, come on now, leave Garfield alone. This cat could probably like barely move with that dang shoe on his head. This ain't right. I'm calling the animal rights activists and, and people and stuff. I'm reporting you. This cat looks like it's about to serve in a British war. Like, like, come on now. It's okay, kitty. Everything happens for a reason. Reason. That was bad. I'm sorry. That was really bad. Like fur. Me when that coronavirus be chasing my butt. <laughs> what the heck? Ew, what is that? Ah, girl, what kind of birthday party is this? Jeez. This looks like an African-American version of the Monopoly man. Hey, no. Girl, do not pass go. Do not collect 200. I don't know. Like, like, are y'all playing a game? Is this like a new activity up in PE or something? Dang. That thing looks terrifying. Like, like, are you Colonel Sanders if he was black? Man. Hey, bro. Halloween is over. You could take the mask off. Is this like some episode of like scared straight? Because if I was a kid and I was always getting into trouble and then that thing started chasing me, ooh, I, I'd be scared straight. I would be on the straight and narrow. I would be like the nicest kid after that. I mean, just look at this thing chasing kid. Like somebody call the cops, arrest this thing. And it's like only chasing this poor girl. Oh, dang, I've never seen such terror in a child's face. This girl's looking like- I knew I should have stayed home today. <laughs> But it feel like the coronavirus be like that though. It do feel like that though. Look at that man. Jeez. Don't eat past eight o'clock, right? Okay, uh. now look, hear me out. Why is there a light bulb in the fridge if we not supposed to eat past eight o'clock? <laughs> I <laughs> look at his face. He is dead serious too. He's just like, I'ma eat past eight o'clock whether you like it or not. It's all right, black man. I'm right there with you. I, I eat all the way up until like 3 a.m. I had me a peanut butter and jelly sandwich up at 3.30 last night. Now look, I can't see his whole body. I'm not saying like he's he's fat or anything, but you know, he's a little bit of a bigger guy. I don't know why, it, it makes it a little bit more uh, 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 funny. The fact that he's just like, you know, he's like a bigger guy. He's like, why? Do they put a light bulb in the fridge if we're not supposed to eat past eight o'clock? I'm like, dang, I, I don't know, man, jeez. Number one, who told you not to eat past eight o'clock? Number B, you gotta ask the refrigerator companies why they put the light bulbs in them. I'm pretty sure they put the light bulbs in them in case if you wanna save electricity, like in your house. Sometimes it gets dark at five o'clock. I mean, you know, in some places, so you don't, you don't know, black man, dang. What kind of podcast is this? I mean, y'all y'all just talk about food and fridges? Y'all need to get a little bit of a better hobby because because I mean, I mean, geez, you can't be spending your 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 time on the podcast talking about not eating past eight o'clock. I swear, this black man probably started a food activist group. He said, I started a group for all the major food groups. <laughs> Jeez. Sugar, fat, meat, and ice cream <laughs> or something. I don't know, I don't know. That's ridiculous, man. I wanna hear this dude's answer to it, though. This dude just looks like a health nut. He, he looks like he does not care. He's just like, uh, do what you want, bro. Look at his face, <laughs> ah, man. You know what, black man? Maybe there's a light bulb so you could drink past eight o'clock. You could have a water. Water past eight o'clock. You ever think about that? Hey, hey. 
There are other things in the fridge aside from food, black man. I mean, you know, yeah, you got your water, you got your condiments, ketchup or mustard. You might need ketchup for like, you know, I don't know, the, the rub it in on, on, a, on, on a cut or something. I don't know, anyway, I'm just kidding, but yeah. Moving on. Check out this TikTok. Okay, you go first. Stop that. Your mom stopped that last night. Banana bread warmed up from Starbucks with the K-pop and a grande soy chai tea latte. Oh my gosh, we are so extra, we are so extra. You guys might remember a vine that Sam and Colby did. It was similar to this, um, so shout out to them. Giving credit to them for the idea. I changed up the wording, but yeah, yeah, it's funny. It was like, check out this TikTok. Okay, okay you, you go, go first. first. Stop, stop that. that. Your, Your mom, mom stopped, stopped that, that last night. night. But you guys know sometimes when you're talking to somebody and then, you know, they talk at the same time and sometimes you say the exact same thing. So, you know, it's crazy, it's crazy. But yeah, this is some relationship goals right here you know I mean when you and your significant other are that in sync to where you're saying the same dang thing at the same dang time I mean come on it's all fun and games till the dogs start flying what the <laughs> okay are you kidding me what the heck man dogs do be acting like that sometimes though when you throw the ball they go like wherever you threw that ball even if you don't even throw a ball if you just fake throw if you're just like uh whoosh the dog like looks up and he's just like where's it at where's it at that's mean though you done made the dog fly all the way up into the sky this dog is higher than snoop dog i mean are you kidding me i wonder if the dog actually got that ball i mean dang moving on uh, white people when Black History Month is finally over. What? Wow. <laughs> Gosh dang. That is just rude, man. Racist. Jeez. Let us black people get one month out of the year. I mean, dang. It's the shortest month. Oh, and it's not even like white people have to do anything during the month. It's just like any other month, except it's ours. But hey, happy Black History Month. Even though it's March right now, but you, you know, um, yeah. White people when Black History Month is finally over. Get that out of here. Gosh dang it, the disrespect, man, is real. When there's no sports on TV, so you decide to watch women's sports for once. Oh, you can't say that, man. Oh, oh wow. If you laugh, that's that 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 that's not right. Don't laugh. Don't do it. Okay, did you laugh? Like, be honest. Comment down below. That <laughs> she's like chopping. Up. She's making food. They're they're cooking. There's nothing wrong with that. There's like so many girls that play sports like basketball, volleyball, soccer, baseball, or softball. But yeah, you know that is messed up, man. I mean, before it was racism, and now it's sexism. I mean, geez, this is ridiculous. But yeah, if you laugh, then you're anti-feminist. No, no, I'm kidding. I'm, I'm I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. That girl really chopping it up though. Good for you, girl, good, good for you. You know what, girl, because your man done made this video, he does not get to eat, okay? He don't, he don't get to eat, that's it. No food for him. I'm in the ghetto. <laughs> <laughs> Why is the dog so mad? Jeez. Dog seems angry, what the heck? I don't know what it is, but these little dogs, they always are just like angry and like mad. They're like very territorial. I'm like, you cannot be this small and talk in a big game. I'm mean, like, like, are you serious? These dogs legit act like they're Doberman Pinchers or they're like Great Danes. I'm like, well, boy, you is this big. All it'll take is like one football punt and then you're gone. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But you guys remember the video, the, I'm in the ghetto, -ta -ta -ta. and she like, I'm in the ghetto. <laughs> oh, nice, nice, very nice. Babe, if you catch this, I'll give you $20. All right. Ready? Yeah. Dang. All right, you know what, babe? If you catch this, I'll give you $1,000. All right. I take cash. Who are you, Jason Bourne? <laughs> Dang, it's messed up because I thought she was actually gonna like throw it towards me. I would've gotten $20. This, I'll give you $20. If you catch this, I'll give you $20. She set me up. I thought she was actually gonna throw it like somewhat my way, but she threw it in the complete opposite direction. Dang, I was ready too. I was like. <laughs> All right, you know what, babe? If you catch this, I'll give you $1,000. All right. And she done caught it. Dang, what a shame. But yeah, please add me on TikTok at Dang Matt Smith. I'm posting daily on there. So yeah, if you want more funny videos, get there, check it out. Wow, that's so cold in here. I turned the heat off because I pay the bills. <laughs> They're all right. That face. Is you questioning me, bro? Well, I've been to the Wi Fi. I turned it off because I pay the bills. Yeah. What's that shit, bro? What's wrong with these kids nowadays? <laughs> Where my bed go? I turned it off. 
Because I pay the bills. <laughs> How you? Hold on, because this ain't making sense. Then the boy. Well, that's my room. I turned it off. Because I, I pay, pay the bills. bills. You better not say no dumb to me. <laughs> just in my room, where did it go? Because I pay the bills. Dang. Now you listen. I don't explain why a whole portion of this house is gone. I ain't telling you my room or I'm calling the police. Seriously though. I don't know if your parents or guardians are like that, but yeah, my my mom definitely was like that. She's like, I turned it off because I pay the bills. Well, I'm paying the bills now, so no, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. What the heck? Black man. Up uh, um, hello? What are you doing on the subway? Jeez. This is what happens when you do drugs. My guy, you got way too much. <laughs> How'd he do that? Dang. That's ridiculous. My guy, you got way too much energy. Jeez. I swear, did your crush text you back? I like you too? Like, like, what, what is this? The, how, do, how do you move? <laughs> wow. Oh, dang. The caption for this should be when you find out you're immune to the coronavirus. <laughs> he did a backflip, went upside down, jumped up on the roof, went upside down, slid, and then dang, man. Wow. I want that much energy. Jeez, one day. When your drug test comes back positive and you didn't even study for it. <laughs> you dummy. Oh my gosh. No, when your drug test comes back positive, that means you do drugs. Gosh, all these people got so much energy. What kind of dance is this anyway? Like, like, bro, what are you doing? Uh, uh, stop, stop that, stop. Come on, man, that's not the renegade. What are you doing? <laughs> Get out of here, man, jeez. What the? What is going on with this cat? Oh, they like uh, anesthesia or something. They like put this cat to sleep. But for some reason, the cat's paws just like stiffened up. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Y'all need to leave this cat alone, okay? I mean, this cat looks like it's up in church and just like, hallelujah, Jesus. Oh man, leave the cat alone. Stop laughing at the cat, that's just mean, dang. It's all fun and games till bro robs the store. Oh no, this bird ain't about to do it. This bird ain't about, dang. Hey, you dang seagull, you gotta pay for that. Seagulls do not care at all. This seagull is like, you know what, I'm hungry. You better give me them Doritos, dang. Hungry, give me this bag of chips and get up on out of here, come on. Man, seagulls stealing chips from the store, boy. You need to get that out of here. Woo, that's gonna do it for reacting to TikToks that are actually funny. Hopefully you guys laughed at some of those. If you did, go ahead, give this video a like and subscribe to the channel. And yeah, go ahead, add me on TikTok at DangMattSmith. I'm posting daily on there, so yeah. And click the links in the description below and check out the Get That Outta Here merch, yeah man. Crowdmade.com slash DangMattSmith, get there you. And hey, you guys be safe out there, and I'ma see ya in the next one. Peace.